Hey you guys, welcome back to another edition of WRE Supercard. Today we've got Team ID results, we've got the RTG preview, and we got kind of a little bit of exhibition. Probably my second, yeah, on my second count. I'm um, training up my second Randy Orton WrestleMania card, and uh, let's show you Fusion Pro Finn Balor. So, yeah, so we'll just go into my main account quickly, show you guys some stuff, and I'll see the ID results there. And I'm not there. And team ring domination. We got around the autumn, obviously, as you saw yesterday. We didn't get Mark Henry, we changed out to be but don't think any really probably get any because of Mark Henry. But we had Irfan leading away with 38 shards. I had 27 shards. Manuel had 22. Sunny D with 21. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Sunny Das Morel. I got given a 75 already. Then we got Wendell of 20. Sit up with 15. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Game Over. Then Eddie with 12, D has 316 with 11. Go and check out his YouTube channel, D with Rock Metal. And Crispy with 8 shards. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Crispy Crazy Card. And Spray with 6 shards. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Crispy Crazy Card. So, yeah. So, next now we've got kind of the RTG gameplay, Emma gameplay preview. So, yeah. We've got Common, Bo Dallas. Go right now, what's well, going on? Then uncommon Ryback, Rare Jimmy Uso. The Usos are always rares and super rare cards. Super rare Stardust, Ultra Lucata, Epic Dean Ambrose, Legendary Brock Lesnar, which is a pro. Some people are logging awards seem to already hate with me because I told him not last week, week before I think it was. No, it was last week, sorry. Then his favorite card is King, which is a single my second account that he's already been pro here and I wouldn't make my deck anyway. Then the WrestleMania card is Big Show. It's another terrible WrestleMania card, but me really, I can't complain because it is a pro for me. So, yeah, and then the WrestleMania card is Bray Wyatt, obviously. So, this is the deck I'm going to be rocking with for a while. We have my main deck in, and then Bray Wyatt. Again, this game's played on Triple H, but regardless, uh, when they max up, they'll be better than my takers and my calls. Wow. I just realized after after this I'm gonna have no that will be a pro. That'll be a pro. Then just put and uh, big show H sooner or later I won't have no um pros in my deck. So I would make pros. So, yeah. So, if you want, yeah, that. So, yeah, that's gonna be cool. I'm gonna only have four, three, sorry, more pros. I'm gonna only have three surviving pro, pro males in my deck. So, yeah, and you'll have two surviving pros. One WrestleMania single and one technically event WrestleMania card. So as you can see, I'm at 9,611 cards. And also, if you want to see any SmackDown, go and check her out. It's only on for two hours. SmackDown's only on for two hours, whereas Raw's on for three hours. Especially Mar Mar Ronaldo as the, the uh, pretty much the um, where I think is the voice of SmackDown. I enjoy SmackDown a lot more than. Monday Night Raw. And also, this is probably a spoiler, but most likely you've seen it by now. SmackDown, they did a six pack challenge number contenders match, which had John Cena, AJ Styles, Bray Wyatt, Baron Corbin, Dolph Ziggler, and then the last spot was to be decided in the Battle Royal match, which Apollo Crews won. So then Apollo Crews was the sixth entrant, and the winner, I wanted him to win, but I didn't expect it to happen, believe it or not. Was Dolph Ziggler? Like he was way under. I reckon he was way, way underused in WWE before the brand split. And within a week after the draft, he's number one contender on SmackDown. That shows how much he was undervalued when he was all raw on SmackDown. So yeah, let's get into the team shot breakdown of my second account. He got 217 charge, we've got the side Mark Henry here, and we we didn't get the triple H, but we just did a phrase shotgun to get 
games played on each other's cards. So I had Prince Jr. 30 shards, Sarko with 30 shards, I had 29 shards, Lil C at 27, HP Love Shaft at 25, Merc at 22, Glenn at 20, Joey at 14, Pokemon Master which is 70, Second Count at 13, and Steve at 7. Also guys, Sarko um, will not be available will not be able to, to um, play much of the team events during the next couple of weeks as he's been on holiday but I'm gonna help him with the team whilst he is away. So let's say we say hi I think do that uh, but him say hi to YouTube guys and then uh, why is it always messed up? I am really, really honored that Sato has picked me to help with the team once he is gone. But I've only been in there, I've only been in Crossos for three weeks. So yeah, I am really, really happy. And if it if it wasn't for Colossus, I would not be in a resume here because if it wasn't for Colossus, I wouldn't have had Sack Rider. I wouldn't have had Randy Orton to make the pro. I wouldn't have had many other cards as well. But yeah, and also got the John Cena counter pro for tomorrow. Just and say hi to YouTube and Jang Lang will go and play my <coughs> second account. Um, I do, do. Here we go. And I, one of my Randy Orton's are done. So, pretty much, it's quite funny. One of my Randy Orton's is Max Lau, 25 from 25, being easy to games played in his cards. And then the other one is Max Lau, is Max games played but not Max Lau. Because Finn's already pro and you'll probably be able to go into my deck now, it's not too important in getting him done. So let's check it, no wins. If I keep yeah, it keeps me right being here, so I'll use Randy and Owen probably as a uh, throwaway tag, and then Ryder and Ryder to fit in there, Ryder and Roman has been main cards. So I'm just trying to get um you know done yeah, if it into my deck. I'm just trying to get and survivor plus now. So yeah, I'm just trying to get Owens and Orton pro before this Road Glory to try and boost my deck up a bit more. The only problem is or it might go to level might go down a bit because no it'll go up actually, sorry, because Randy will be getting a bit will be willing to rest me in pro. And the single of Randy will be getting replaced by a Kevin Owens survival throw. So, yeah, so let's use Randy first. It's gonna lose. I should have used Roman and Oxy Proct. My Roman ain't max leveled. Um, Roman Reigns. So, yeah, I'm not too bothered about losing matches either. It's just trying to get cards done as quick as possible. Trying to get my tear up as quick as possible as well. So we go shard on page with a victory there. And we're not too sure I'm debating essentially not playing this RTG because it's a survivor cane, although all survivor cards could help me out. Plus I'm close to my large reward. Let's go to it. I played six foes on well, bang on six foes on one hundred games. And for six foes in four hundred games it'll be in a random leave of my account rarity. So um, that's making you when I play it, so I probably will let to send up playing it. So we can play another four matches, we won that one, hopefully we can win the majority of these other four. So, yeah, Mark Henry against Mark Henry. Yeah, so Charlotte. I'll probably bring over Charlotte in when season three comes out if we can bring up the cards. Because I quite like the picture. Let's use Kevin Owens. And also guys, if you probably already seen Raw as well. 
you haven't go and check out because we've got a new title being announced being announced the match for that is Finn Balor versus Seth Rollins for the WWE Universal title and also we've got a new Divas Champion in Sasha Banks so, yeah so pretty good Robert as I said I preferred Smackdown I don't know it's a shame that they didn't put Mara Ronaldo and Corey Graves together because Corey Graves was the best one out of the commentators on Raw and Mara was the best on Smackdown this probably got them as the two main like put them separately because otherwise they've Byron JBL and Michael Cole have really really stale and if so they needed Corey or more on one on like separate brands so or it wouldn't get stale I'm just gonna give away the victory there so yes as I said there's a shame but it's probably for the best really so the candidates don't make as much mistakes but then JBL made a couple of mistakes like I've seen wrong people etc etc same with Michael Cole how much more have you got? He's done in power words, it's just toughness, speed, charisma. So we'll get him done for definite tonight. And what's Randy? Probably get Randy done tonight as well if I play enough. Let's play John Sigler. This is going to be the last match for today, you guys, and then we will be out of here. So, yeah. I'm on a roll at the moment for the record it, recording. And I want, and before we leave as well, obviously, we'll check the Jang Lang team chat, see if anything. Said I'm going to say hi, say hi to YouTube, and I'm going to start King of the Ring. So yeah, last King Ring, I annoyingly got semi bumped. So, which was Saturday or Sunday, but one of the rewards I had, I was happy about because for a while, <coughs> for a while now, I wanted the Survivor Sting card so I can put the Super Air Crow Sting on it. So, because it's got the title, because you can't see the title match on the WrestleMania Sting. And I had Sting and Sheamus. Sheamus was an awful reward to get, but Sting, not so bad. He's not exactly the best favorite card. They made it his favorite card pretty weak, I believe. But his rest, WrestleMania card is one, it's in the top 10, I believe. So, yeah. So, that was the last match we did lose there. But I really want that Trish Stratus WrestleMania Fusion. As well, if they get Trish and Macho Man, are the ones I want the most, most likely, and take and to take one for the because I want to take a picture of the hat. If I get those three, those three, most likely be three of the ones that I bring over as a resume infusions. I, I like 12 dreads if you can still bring them over. So, yeah, so not no one said anything on the Colossus chat, but they all know, do get shot anyway. Yeah, and does anyone say anything here? No, probably all this have mostly out Wednesdays is people's days off because no team event. The only thing they really need to do is the um money in the bank. So is there anything I wanna I should change here? No. What ethics have I got? Because um, Fuji, I, I've been watching Fuji's videos. He's been sandbagging epic, some of epic tags, but no legendaries. What? That can't be right. Uh, maybe they're super as, but no part of the ones. So let's just leave it as uh, if I can get a crack left, a card like left arrow or an up arrow of Neville, I'll use them. So begin King of the Ring. So there we go. So that is going to be it for today, guys. We will be back then soon with another edition of WWE Supercard. I have been your host, uh, Mitch from Team Jang Lang and Class of Saying Enough. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe down below for, below for more. And don't forget, peace.